What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, you enjoy my content and my gabby mouth, you can smash the sub button and be notified for future readings. Just saying, just saying, saying. Um, this is a uh, collective reading, Taps Beside You, Everybody in Between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it fly. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. I got a channeled in, so I decided to do this message, so I'm going to do it. Come on, baby. Come on. Um, the channel I received was um, a cycle of abuse is over for one particular family um, because of action taken by um, an adult in the family. Um, um, and then I heard um, the group that abused the family, some members, I heard some members, some members of the group of the family, I mean, some members of the group that abused the family is going to attempt to come back and convince um, one of the parents that it was an initiation, but it wasn't, is what I heard. And um, then a few minutes after that, I heard what some members of the group don't understand is negative karma is going to cycle around. And when their children are older, they will be abused. That's what I heard. That's pretty strong. That's horrible. That is horrible. That is horrible. But that is what I heard. So you plug it in, however that resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, I didn't hear Secret 7, but dear God, it makes me think Secret 7. All freaking day long, it does. It makes me think Secret 7 all day long. Um, I didn't hear Secret 7, but it does make me think Secret 7. So you plug it in, how it resonates, but that's Secret 7 or not, that's terrible. I mean, because, you know, it really would fit in Secret 7 because it was a group that abused a family. Um, but if, if we're talking about the one, the original Secret 7 in Huntsville, um, that one is over. Now, there are others, one, other ones that are still going on, but a lot of you guys have forwarded it in your own homes. Um, you've prevented it in your own home, your own dwelling, your own space, and kudos to you. A lot of people have really fought against this crap. A lot of people have. Um, we've really done good combating it on this channel. We really, really have. Um, but a group, one of the groups that was abusing a family, I didn't hear what specific location, but um, it makes me automatically think the original Secret 7, because that's the one I always pull in, for the most part. Um, they want to come back. They want to come back down. They want to come back to single mom Leo and convince her that it was an initiation. Um, she's definitely not going to have it. And she will call the police. Someone needs to hear this. Someone's having a huge wake up call. Oh my God. Whoa. See, these people keep going in cycles. They keep going in cycles. They keep, they should have just been honest at the freaking beginning. And none of this crap would have ever happened. Just seriously. These people are toxic. I mean, and I'm just serious. It's really sad. It's sad. They have caused deaths in the community. They have caused grief and heartache and unnecessary grief and heartache in a community. And deaths. I mean, it's really sad. It's sad, is what it is. It's damn sad. And I mean, it's sad. I just don't know how to say it. It's it's freaking sad, is what it is. But I heard the group wants to come back and convince probably single mom Leo, but you plug it in however it resonates in your life, if it does, that it was an initiation. Well, okay. It's not an initiation because she was never initiated anything. She was just straight up abused. Her and her kids were straight up abused. There was no initiation into anything. She owns that home. It was her home to begin with. So I don't know what the hell they think they were initiating her into. She's single as a Pringle, still paying mortgage on her home. So what the hell do they think they were initiating her into? I'm just being for real about this. 
I mean, I'm not even going to do any parts. We're just going to talk about it. And I'm serious about this. I'm serious, you guys. I mean, I know I'm not on live. Y'all can't chat me. But I would love to have y'all on live right now. Because seriously, what the hell was she being initiated into? Or anybody, any single mom, anybody, or single dad, anybody that had a hidden camera up in their house with children. The kids being abused and her being abused. Or him being abused if it's a male. Nothing. Not being initiated into a freaking thing is what you're not being initiated into. So they can try to come back and convince her all day long or convince a dude all day long. That's the case. But I would hope to God, if you're the one they're trying to come back and convince this to, I hope you laugh at them and then call the police. Because I heard the police would probably be called. And they really should be. And I'm serious about that. I'm serious. That's some sick, sick shit. That's sick. I heard, but what some of these, it's some of the members of the group going to try to come back. So, if it's secret 7 slash 10, I heard some members. So, not all members of the group, but some members. So, now they want to gaff it off. Now they want to laugh it off because they're not making money off them now. But, I heard what they don't realize is when some of their, because they have children. Some of these people have children. So, some of the members that are going to try back and come back and convince single mom Leo or single mom or single dad, anybody that, um, had camera in her, their house abusing them and their children, that it was an initiation, are some of their children, their, some of their kids, when they get older, are going to end up being abused, and, and that's part of the negative karma. And, you know, you're these people are going to have to live with themselves. They're going to have to live with themselves the rest of their damn life for what they did. And I'm serious, I'm serious about that. They are going to have to live with it. And I heard someone's having a huge wake-up call in here, and they freaking should. They should. Because it's sick. It's sickening. It is sickening if anybody needs to hear that. And I mean it. I mean it. I mean it. I mean it. From the bottom of my heart. I just don't know what to say about that. I mean it. Let me see if I hear anything else. A particular Aquarius of this group is about to be transferred to a completely different location soon. He's going to get extreme backlash. Extreme backlash. But he has connections in the legal system that's going to protect him. Oh my God. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay. I heard a particular Aquarius in this group. So for talking secret seven, there was an Aquarius masculine in the group. Um, I heard he's about to start getting extreme backlash, extreme backlash. I'm assuming he still lives in the secret seven community. I'm thinking we're talking the original secret seven community. Cause if I hear other secret sevens, I usually hear specifically what they are. I'm thinking it's the original one, but you plug it in how it resonates. But I heard he's about to start getting extreme, extreme backlash from the community. So I think he still resides in the original Secret 7 community. Um, but I heard he's going to get a transfer. He's going to get a transfer to a, a completely different area soon. Um, he has connections in the legal community. So I think he is either a family. I think he's a family member of, some, of, of a judge. I think he's a family member of a judge or a lawyer. And I'm serious about that. Absolutely do. I didn't hear that part. That's just my deductive reason and the logic. I already has connections in the legal um, system. So I, uh, I, that's my deductive reason and the logic. I think he's a family member of a judge up in that courthouse. Or he's a family member of a lawyer up in that works in that courthouse. And I'm serious about that. Because I heard it's going to happen soon. It's going to happen soon. So once he starts gets bullied, he bullied that damn family for years. But now that he's starting to get bullied by the community, oh my God, the rich money, money, money people are going to help him out. But they didn't think nothing of the poor little family that was being abused for about two years. 
I mean, where's the sympathy and empathy and equality in that? And I'm being serious about that. That's an effed up shiznet. Someone else is having a huge wake up call. Heard someone else is having a huge wake up call. I'm serious. I'm serious, you guys. That is effed up. Poor little baby can't take the heat. Now that he's getting it, but he can dish it out all day long. No, nay, nay. That's not the way it works. It's supposed to be equality, not about money and who you know and who has the biggest pocketbooks and who's going to help little niecey nephew out when they're crying wolf. Because some people don't have people to help them out when they cry wolf, i.e. people like me that works hard for every damn dime they've ever had in their whole freaking life. I mean, that's some effed up shiznit. It is. That pisses me off. Obviously, that Aquarius has some um, deep pocketbooks in his family or his connections. He obviously does in the legal community. I didn't hear it was his family specifically, but it makes me feel it is. Just saying. That's sick. This particular community has many people they are spying on. Many people. And this Aquarius gets paid very good money to spy. Oh my, oh my God. Oh my God. What the hell? Oh my God. Oh, whoa. You, oh. You plug it in how it resonates. Oh my God. Okay, so not only is he going to get helped out by his little richy rich legal system pals, whether it's family or not, but he gets paid good ass money to spy on many people in the community. So many hidden cameras. So you get paid to watch people take their clothes off and spare people's butts and boobs. And God, children, I hope to God, not children. I'm speaking to you, Aquarius. Or whoever the else the hell is involved in this. Just saying. That's sick. That's some sick ass shit. I heard good money. And you're going to get your richy rich little legal frizz to help you transfer out so you can go keep spying on people in another town. They don't know who the hell you are. Well, you do you not think about the little family? The Secret Seven family, now they have to deal with the entire community spying at their ass. Because that's what happened. You had the whole fucking community spying in on them. So now they have to deal, still, with backlash going out in the community, fearing people are going to be out, acting all cray-cray on them. Because that's what happened for a while. Until y'all officially shut, shut the shit down. And I guess now you're just staring. That's some sick shit. But I heard this Aquarius is um, uh, spying on many people. Many people. So it wasn't just single mom Leo. I'm feeling it's the original Secret Seven community. Because I heard they're spying on them for strategic reasons. Well, that's not correct, people. Just saying, just saying. That's not correct. Woo-woo! 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 Just saying. That's not correct. There is a, there's a thing called privacy for a reason. There's laws for privacy, federal laws for privacy for reasons. And apparently this Aquarius gets paid good money for it. Well, hell, I'm sitting over here working off YouTube. Why don't you pay me? Just saying, just saying. Where's the equality in that? Because there's not. That pisses me off. Let me see if I hear anything else. I heard some of these people's kids are going to be end up being abused when they're older because of karma of these nasty ass people. Not just as Aquarius. I'm pulling in this one specific Aquarius. Aquarius, original Aquarius is Secret Seven, I'm feeling. Um, but it's several people in this little Secret Seven slash 10. Their kids are going to end up being abused because they ended up abusing the Secret Seven home. Karma cycling around. That's sick. Woo woo, woo woo, woo woo. Just saying.
Several shocking series of chain of events will occur with this soon. Several. Things are going to start moving real, real fast, real soon. Okay, I heard several so shocking series of chain of events are going to occur with this. Several things are going to start moving real, real fast, real soon. So probably getting that Aquarius out of town is one of the uh, events. Um, I hope, I mean, dear God, um, I wonder what other several shocking series of chain of events. Hell, I've been wanting to leave this town for a hot-ass minute. I had the damn police call, um, police called on me. You know, I'm a very peaceful person, but yet I get the police called on me. So I'm just saying, I mean, I've been wanting to leave this town for a hot ass minute too, but where's been my meal ticket out? But yet I'm stuck here. But yet this Aquarius that's committed crimes and spying on people, staring at people's uh, butts and boobs, um, gets to go a free, free meal ticket because they have connections. Where's the equality in that? Because there's not. There's not. Zero equality in that. That's some sick shit. If anybody needs to hear that, I'm closing it. But I'm serious. That pisses me off, you guys. I mean, I'm not pissed at y'all. I'm pissed at the situation. Because that's sick. Not, not cool. Not cool. Many deaths occurred in that Secret 7 situation because of black magic that was displayed in that poor single mother's house. By crazy black magic assholes. People lost their lives because of this crap. And yet, the innocent people are the ones paying the prices. Sounds like politics, if you ask me. Which is some sick shit. There should be fairness and equality. And I'm sorry, but not sorry. That Aquarius deserves every negative shit that's coming to them. And I mean it. As is every other member of the Secret 7 slash 10. Every bit of it. And I mean it from the bottom of my heart chakra. I don't care if it was a family member of mine or not. If they did it, they deserve it. Period. I wish other people felt that way. I'm getting off of here. I love you guys. I'm not mad at y'all. I'm not mad at y'all. I'm just mad at the situation. I'm, I mean, I'm, I'm getting messages that a freaking the Aquarius, it sounds like the original uh, Aquarius of the Secret Seven is about to basically get a um, get out of town free card. And I've been wanting to take my kids and freaking flee the town for freaking years. And everybody in my mama's been knowing that. But I've been held back because I was wrongfully terminated three times in the damn year. And I haven't had money to get out of the damn town because people keep blocking my damn money. Because I didn't have money to get a lawyer to do the wrongful terminations, and everybody knew that. That's some effed up shit. It just really is. And I'm mad about that. Because it shouldn't occur. Alright, I'm getting off of here. Love you guys. Namaste.